What's up, guys? I'm Harry Gone. Welcome back to episode 39 of this Pokemon Boltwide 2 Egglock Challenge. In the last episode, we pretty much just got our eighth Gym Bad spoiler alert. And I. Wait, did we lose a Pokemon? We did lose a Pokemon, I think. I'm not sure. We lost a Pokemon sometime uh, within the last few episodes. But we did get our eight Gym Bads, though. And now we are going to be progressing a lot more with the storyline today. And uh, just to make sure. Just to show you guys, we have got all eight of our gym badges right there. And so the plan for the day is to go on into Route 22, I think, and uh, start trying to find some more Team Plasma members to progress with the storyline again. And we're also going to try hatching an egg after we do this to start off this episode, which we ran into Teraki on this episode. Or we ran into, into Teraki on the end of last episode, and now we're going to try to see if we can catch him and add him to the egg swap list. We do have a Master Ball still. We do have one Master Ball still in our bag. And I don't know if I want to use it on this Terrakion yet. Because we do have like the Reshiram encounter and the Curum encounter. So all that th good stuff. But let's get a quick team recap because we got our newest member to our team. Generic, the Hydreigon. Not the Hydreigon. The Drudigan, level 60 now. I trained him to level 60. Holding the Draco Plate. Draco Plate. Brave Nature with sheer force of building those Glare, Crunch, Thunderfang, Dragon Claw. And I plan to Glare the Terrakion so it can be easier to catch in the future. And he has beast attack stats. That's gonna be, he's gonna be good for us. Next up, we got Flipper the Dugong holding the Mystic Water with Thick Fat Ability, No Surf, Ice Beam, Iron Tail, and Signal Beam. Next up, we got Tum Tum the Dum Dum. <laughs> the Snorlax level 60 holding the Leftovers with Thick Fat Ability as well. No Curse, Strength, Body Slam, and Surf. I need to get rid of Surf or something else because that is not really the ideal thing to have on a Snorlax. But it's just there because we have Flipper with Surf already, so we don't really need Surf on Tum Tum anymore. But anyway, next up we got Zero, the MVP, Zero, the Zangoose, holding the Choice Band with Toxic Boost ability, knows Fire Punch, Ice Punch, X Scissor, and Slash. He's just deadly, man. He uses his hands all over the place. <laughs> Freddy Krueger right there. Next up we got Bruce Lee, the Hitmon Lee, level 60, holding the Black Belt with Reckless ability, knows Close Combat, Low Sweep, Earthquake, and Fake Out. And last but not least, we got our boy Taras, the Drapion, level 60, holding leftovers with battle armor ability. So we can't get critted on any time today. And he knows x Scissor Crunch, Cross Poison, and Iron. So all these little X's today. This is the X-rated episode, am I right? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Alright, so yeah, we're going to be going on and trying to catch this Terrakion. Hopefully, we can catch it. And we don't lose a Pokemon. Okay. <laughs> All right, here we go. Let's try attacking this Terrakion. If we don't, if we have to run away from it, it's not really that big of a deal because we still have two egg swaps we have to do, and we're gonna get one for sure today. And he's only level 50, so I'm 10 levels above this Terrakion. And I, Jordan is pretty slow, so I'm not gonna really do anything against him. He's using Sacred Sword, which shouldn't be that. It shouldn't do that much, but it kind of did actually. That's kind of scary. All right, but Thunder Fang is my weakest move, so I'm gonna go ahead and use it right now. It shouldn't kill the Terrakion. It shouldn't kill it. It shouldn't. Never mind. Never mind. Crit! That was the most anticlimactic, fast kind of. Oh my gosh. Generic. The first move I. That's actually a good sign, but it's bad for me right now. But it's a good sign in the long run because the first move I used with generic. Or, yeah, with generic was a crit. So he's going to be putting it in work probably. He's going to be probably putting in work. <laughs> and I battled this person off of cam. Um, I forgot which way is the city, though. There was Lisa and Tate. That's how I freaking lost my Pokemon. Okay. But that sucks. Okay, so we don't have to do anything. Oh, Piloswine. But man, the first move I used with Generic is a crit. It's good, but that sucks for the freaking Trachyon. So there goes the Trachyon. We, are not, we cannot catch Legendaries, guys. I'm just not cut out to catch Legendaries. I'm not... I'm terrible with catching legendaries. I'm just gonna be honest with you guys. I'm terrible. I'm horrible, man. I'm horrible. Okay, but anyway. So yeah, let's go ahead and head back on to the city over here. And then we'll progress in Route 22 after this. Because uh, we're gonna go ahead and hatch some Pokemon for today's episode. Which should be in the Pokemon Center right here. And I got great news for you guys. Remember how in the last in the episodes, like for like 10 episodes back ago... I told you guys that I lost my phone, and I just need to wait until August until I can get the phone back that I lost. I got my I got my regular phone back, guys. I got my phone back. It's good to have my my actual phone back. Oh man, it is so high tech for me. I didn't realize how high tech it was until I had to downgrade to my other phone. But so we got our 
We got our handy dandy uh, dice roll app on here. We got our lighter app on here. And I recently found a Pokedex app on here so we don't have to use our computer to look up any Pokemon in the Pokedex. We just use my handy dandy uh, Pokedex app on my phone right here. And I don't have to lag my computer or anything like that. So, I'm gonna go to get out my dice roll app first because, uh, yeah, we're about to hatch an egg. And uh, Pico, SG Goku, and Swap. Um, wait, 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 wait. I thought we had two encounters we can do. Oh no, here it is right here, Mean Fu. I guess I forgot to swap this, fill in the gaps whenever I got my Dredigan back on the team. Okay, so... Which one we got? We got this, uh, Love Disc first, actually. So we're gonna go ahead and swap out this Love Disc right now. So let's put Drapion right there just for the heck of it. And we're gonna swap out this Love Disc. Holding the Heart Skill, let's take that Heart Skill because we do... Might, we might want to get that for a future move references. All right, so anyway, freaking B Dito, man. B Dito. Okay, so we hatched four in here. I think we actually did leave off in box one. Yeah, 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 we did leave off in box one. So I'm going to go ahead and go all the way back. And we're going to hatch our first egg in the next round in box one right here. So let's get out my handy dandy dice roll app. And there we go. Okay. Roll the dice, roll the dice. And we got, there's no row six, so let's re-roll. And we got row five, column three. All right, so that's next, kind of next to the pig, that tepig right there. So row five, column three. Boom! And we got Asura, Asura, <laughs> Asura, wait, Azura? I don't know how to pronounce that, to be honest. Azura holding TM 35. Huh, okay. And now we can get our handy dandy di our Pokedex app. It's called Data Dex. I don't know if it's uh it's on Android for sure. It's oh you can't even see it. It's called Data Dex. That's the app I'm using. Uh, I don't know if it's on Apple or I don't know if it's on the iOS, but it definitely is on Android. So that's what I'm using right now. So that's what I'm gonna be using, and hopefully it's correct and all the data is correct compared to the Pokemon database that I use. And oh wait, what am I doing? What am I doing? I just need to hatch Azura right here. Oh Azura, I would guess it's just a Manaphy. I don't know why that Pokemon just like randomly popped in my head right now. So I'm going to just go ahead and guess it's a Manaphy. I have no idea what it could be. I could have looked at the TM, but I was too lazy. We'll find out right now. Survey says, oh, oh, <laughs> it's a Heatmore. That's actually really cool. That's, I, I would be down to use that as a fire type. I'm sorry we had to chimp in the last episode, but this Heatmore is actually really unique. I never, I, actually, I never actually used a Heatmore before, so that's actually a really good Pokemon. And what's TM35 again? I don't know, we'll find out. Alright, so actually we're going to go ahead and find out what this, if this Heatmore is 100% legit. So let's go ahead and search up a Pokemon real quick. Oh man, this is like so convenient for me now. Alright, so it's a Calm Nature Heatmore, and we'll go ahead and see that. Ooh. That's a nice moveset, actually. It has white smoke. Prevents other Pokemon from lowering its stats. Okay. All right, so let me go ahead and go into the black 2 and white 2 generation. All right, and its ability, it has white smoke. is a hidden ability, which is perfect for here. And so now let's go into the hidden moves. Okay, so these all have to be egg moves right here for the Inferno. Inferno. Okay, so Heat Wave is an egg move. Night Slash is an egg move. And Inferno is not an egg move in black 2, white 2. Ooh, Incinerate is, but not Inferno. Can you even learn Inferno? It learns Inferno at level 61. So that's not really a legit move unless this thing is kind of, uh, unless this Pokedex is not telling the truth. But it's just one move. Inferno's just one move. We can honestly replace it whenever we level it up to level 45. So. I'm going to say that's a legit heat more that we can use in the future as long as we forget Inferno and teach him it once we level it up to level 45. Or once he gets to level 61 if we end up using it. But once he gets to level 45, we can just forget Inferno, to be honest. So, And I can honestly teach him that TM that uh, that was given to us. I think that might have been Flamethrower. Something like that. Oh, wait, no. Mean Foo, get out of here. Okay, so let's get... Okay, so we're going to swap this guy right here. Swap this person over here, and let's get Inferno. Oh, let's get uh, not Inferno. 
<laughs> let's get Drapion back on the team, and there we go. So, so far we don't have to really, uh, whatchamacallit? Whatchamacallit? We don't have to really just change up our team just yet. And, okay, it's winter. It is the beginning of August as I'm recording this. Fun fact, you guys, uh, this is the first video that I'm recording in August in this new month right here. So, the, so yeah, the, uh, whatchamacallit, the season has indeed changed then. So it's right, this emulator is correct as far as changing the emulator, or as far as changing the season. And one thing I did realize though, I think I was supposed to, uh... I don't think this is episode 49, or 39 as I said in the beginning of this episode. I think this is little episode 40 because I... Something just rang on me right now is that I actually didn't edit one of the videos that I was supposed to edit before. I don't know why they just came across me right now. I have a feeling I recorded episode 39. It's supposed to be episode 40 right now. But I didn't end up editing episode 39 yet. And I was supposed to have uploaded today. But I thought I didn't have any poke any uh, episodes to record right now. I don't know if that's right or not. <laughs> I really don't know if that's if that's right or not. I don't know what the heck's up with my... <laughs> I don't know what the heck I'm episode I'm on right now actually I could go on here oh wait I don't need a bike okay so I did say that there was a hidden grotto somewhere that we're gonna try going to find in a little bit I do have my max repel on we found a poison barb Ooh, that could be pretty good for us all right so we can go over here we could battle that guy if we wanted to and I don't have my max repel on Okay, I, I want to go ahead and put my max repel on because we don't really need to train, it, train up anymore because all these guys are like level 46s. Jeez. So th that means those trainers are going to be like level 50s. And that tells me that we're going to be 10 levels above all these uh, trainers on this route right here. So let me go ahead and put my max repel on. And we I actually see a cave on the top left of the corner. So we can go ahead and try going over there and get another encounter. Which is always good to have no more encounters extra in the box. So let's go ahead and try that. If we can get out of here. Okay, we can. But I kind of want to go check if th that hidden grotto is a thing or not. So I'm going to go over here. Let's get a little... Let's get an extra item for us. Ooh, max potion. That's actually a good one right there. Alright. But yeah, so I finally got my phone back, guys. <laughs> After a whole month of using my old phone back from like four years ago. I finally got my regular phone back. Galaxy S6. It's not that new, but it is something that's good, though. It still works perfectly good for me. And so I'm happy about that. And moment of truth. can Do I have the ability to recognize hidden grottos now? I do. I do. This is a hidden grotto. Hopefully there's another Pokemon in here. Survey says... Oh, it's just a hidden... It's just an item. Well, what is it? A Great Ball. Really? I, found, I went all the way to this hidden grotto just to get a great ball. Well, I mean, great balls are my lucky ball, but it's not that great. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, well. Okay. So, now we can go over here, progress on with this part right here. I have no idea where this is going. But this is the giant chasm. Chasm? Chasm? I don't know how to pronounce that, to be honest. But we're going to get another encounter in here as long as we... Oh, we found more Team Plasma members. Okay, so we can fight Team Plasmas and then once our Max Repel wears off, we can go ahead and get an encounter on here. But first things first, let's go ahead and send up Zero up front because he's our most deadly guy. And all of our Pokemon are only levels are on the same level, so we could start over-leveling some, some of our Pokemon if we want to. Er, how long does wait until everyone else arrives mean exactly? Er, the area past here is important. The people heading to Route 21 are definitely important, but we have an important role as well. Do y'all now? Okay, let's not use another Max Repel, and we can run into encounter right about now. Okay, never mind. Okay, let's get that. Okay, I, I thought it was gonna be a Pokemon, but we end up finding a Ground Gym instead. <laughs> okay, so okay, here we go. Here's the Giant Chasm encounter. Survey says a Gold Bat. That's something I don't want to see actually, because Gold Bats are really hard to catch for some reason. They're just so annoying. There's just such trolling Pokemon, but. Hopefully we can get through it. I could go into Bruce Lee and fake out, but actually, you know, Golbat is a flying type, so it can screw me up any time of the day. Um, what should I do? What should I do? Should I go into Flipper? I could go into Flipper and Signal Beam. I'm gonna go ahead and try doing that. As long as Golbat doesn't have like some sort of fighting type move that can screw up Flipper, 
I should be good. So let's see. Poison Fang. How much is that going to do? Flipper is kind of frail, but he's not that frail. So, ha! Let's go to use Beam. That shouldn't kill the Golbat. Because it is, he does resist it. And it's not stab. Oh my gosh, that does nothing. Let's go and surf it then. Screw this Golbat. He's not going to kill my Flipper. That was a crit too. This surf shouldn't kill it. Dang, that Sinnoh Beam actually did jack squat. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay, let's switch out now. Let's switch out now. Let's go into Taras because obviously Taras can take any of these poison fangs for days. And this Golbat is in the red now, so we can actually go ahead and try chugging our Pokeballs at it. And he used Air Cutter. He predicted that switch, man. He predicted that switch. That little punk. That little punk. <laughs> nah, but anyway. Oh, I closed out my uh, egg list, but it's okay. We still have... We still have 20 Cherish... We still have 20 Pokeballs to use from that we got in the beginning of this whole entire series. That's crazy. That's crazy. One. Two. Three. Got the Golbat on our first try, man. If only we can do that with Legendaries. <laughs> Alright, but anyway, this is the Giant Chasm Encounter, level 44. And we will save that. So we have two Pokemon... So we have two swaps to do in the box still. Hashtag rhymes. We got two swaps to do in the box. Oh, <laughs> no. Okay, so now let's go in and swap this guy out. And sw swow. Swow. <laughs> no. Swap. All right, there we go. We got two. We got the gold bat there. And now we can leave and go back into Route 22 or 21. Route 22. So we have to find something in here. But I don't know what. I really don't know what because... Where are we supposed to be going, honestly? Uh. Oh, I don't have my Max Repel on, that's why. I was like, wait, why did we run into an encounter right here? <laughs> wait, okay, it's a Mean Shao and a Pile of Swine. Okay, I can honestly run away, so I'm gonna go ahead and do that right now. Right? I could run away. Yeah, I can. Okay, whew. <laughs> Good thing, because I saw Flipper's freaking HP right there, and I was like, oh shoot. He's not, he can't battle. He definitely can't battle. Okay, let's put on a Max Repel again, and... Let's go see where the heck we can go from here. Honestly, where, where are we supposed to go? Harry said we're supposed to go... Okay, so we're in Humalao City again. But Harry did say we're supposed to be coming out and uh, seeing what we can find on Route 22. But there's nothing here. I just wasted my Max Repel just to come back to the Pokemon Center. <laughs> I just barely realized that. Okay, so we got an egg swap for today's episode. So that's... We didn't completely waste our time today, but... We honestly have no idea where we're supposed to be going right now. I really don't know why. And fun fact, I have two weeks left until my, until uh, I cannot record anymore in this in this location in this house over here. Two weeks left until I'm done recording in this house. So I actually, I don't know. I think this might be my last week here. Cause I'm not gonna. Ha I'm gonna bring my mic with me whenever I go over to my apartment. Cause I got my uh, new apartment. I moved in, like uh, three days, two days ago actually. And man, my schedule is gonna be crazy. It's gonna be a crazy schedule. But hopefully we can. Hopefully I'll be able to still record and finish up this series because I really want to do that. Definitely want to finish up this series before. What you call it? Before I move out because. I don't want to, I don't like leaving series unfinished, like, that's, that's terrible, that's terrible. So hopefully I can finish the series within the next few days, or anything like that. And since we got strength, we can stop going across all these routes, and let's go ahead and make our shortcut right there, and there we go. Alright, here we go, so now we're gonna be, keep on going into Route 22, this is a new place that we haven't been to, so, let's keep on going, let's see how powerful these journeys are. But yeah. I just really realized, because uh, this weekend, it's uh, the first weekend in August, or not the first, the second weekend in August, apparently, I'm going to be moving all my stuff over to my new apartment, and uh, so I'm, I don't know if I'm going to be bringing my, uh, my recording equipment there or not, or should I wait on that, but if something tells me I should, I, I'm going to have to move my recording equipment to the apartment whenever I finish, or whenever I move out this weekend. So, because I'm not going to be coming back here to move anything else after this weekend. So that kind of sucks. I'm going to be here next week. I just really realized I'm going to be here all next week without having anything to, whatchamacallit, without having anything to record with. 
Unless I get out my old mic or something, but that's not gonna be fun. And oh shoot, Zero is out against Lucario. Why did I stay in? Choice ban, please, please, please. Oh, oh, thank God Zero KOs Lucario with a fire punch with the choice ban. Oh my gosh. That could have been GG game over for us right there. Oh my gosh. Oh, Zero would have got right by a close combat right there. Ooh, okay. Okay, I see you, Zero. Put in the work. Killed or be killed. That is his mentality right there. All right. So, actually, I just barely realized, though, since I'm going to be moving all my recording equipment out this weekend, I have to finish this series before this weekend. Today is Thursday as I'm recording this. So, I have two days to finish this series, guys. Two days to pre-record, bulk record this whole series. Wow. I, I didn't realize that until now. I don't know how many episodes I had to record to finish up this series before I leave, but wow. I mean, I could edit all my videos all I want to. But I can't record anymore after this. I really can't record anymore after this weekend. Well, then again, well, I'm not going to have my webcam, so I can't record like reactions or anything like that. Well, I do. I will have my laptop, though. I could record off of my laptop. Actually, yeah. Okay, I got a calcium. Okay. So this is kind of pointless to come over here. But yeah, I'm, I'm going to have my laptop. I could I could record actually whenever I come back home after this weekend. No, I can. As long as I have all my files like uh, transferred over to my... Uh, oh, shoot. As long as I have all my files transferred over to my laptop because i'm I, I have all my files saved on this pc right here right now i don't have anything on my laptop so yeah i'm gonna definitely have to work transfer over all that stuff but that shouldn't be a problem okay good so i just so i just like i just cleared up the air for myself right there just like telling myself okay i don't have to finish this series before this weekend <laughs> i don't have to finish the series before this weekend so thank god thank god Okay, but where the heck are we supposed to be going, though? I, I kind of want to pause the video and, like, find out where I'm supposed to be going. Wait, he said Route 21, right? Yeah, they mentioned Route 21, so I guess we can go to Route 21. And I just wasted, like, four Max Repels just by walking around here right now. This is kind of sad. <laughs> but, okay, let's keep on going. All right, let's go back to Route 21 since that's where Team Plasma was hinting, hinting us to be going. Okay. So where is Route 21? Um, let's check my map actually. Town map, where you at? All right, all right. Route 21 is. That's the Marine Tube. Route 21 is under Humalau City. So let's go back over there. I don't know why I didn't listen to the Steam Plasma members. I'm an idiot. I, I, man, if I had to, if my life depended on reading text and getting guided based on like what I read. I would be I would be screwed so hard. <laughs> okay, so let's go back to Route 21. All right, sorry about that. I had to go ahead and take care of some stuff because somebody came home and so I had to stop recording and all that stuff. But all right, let's just keep on going. We're gonna go to Route 21 and we really have like about six minutes left in this episode right here. So uh, yeah, I didn't mean to. Uh, so we're on Route 21 and this is the surfing route right here. So this looks like a bunch of water types. So that kind of tells me we're gonna have to put in generic, but it's kind of scary because water types. Also can also have a uh, ice type Pokemon in it, but hopefully generic can pull through with this Thunder Fang and Thang. You know what I'm saying? Oh, <laughs> I'm in the rhyming mood today because okay, so I'm gonna let you on a little secret. If somebody came home when I was recording uh, before I before I made a cut like a few seconds ago, and then I stopped recording for that whole day. So this is a whole new day that I'm recording. I'm just gonna add it on to the the, the end of episode 40 right now, and. Uh, but between today and between yesterday and today, I just barely finished my biggest my big project that I was telling you guys for like this whole entire series that I plan that could have finally start planning a release date, start promoting my uh, project on both of my channels, and uh, we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. I'm so excited! Because I finally finished the project after so many months. I didn't even I don't even know. I'm I'm so glad I finally was able to finish it before this summer ended, and. Uh, so yeah, I'm 
<laughs> this is like a little you're probably guys i don't know if you guys are gonna be watching this far to see this little announcement right here but you'll guys see some things coming out on this channel on this channel and my other channel to promote what's coming in the future so that's all i have to say about that and i i should have bought repels when i was back over there in the whatchamacallit in the on the, in human house city i should have got stopped in the pokemon center and got the max repels but oh well <laughs> i just forgot about it but yeah, oh, hello, she's in that bikini, she's looking fine. <laughs> nah, all right, oh, easy, love this too. All right, that's cool, that's cool, that's cool. We're only level 50, so we are still like 10 levels above all these chainers right here, which I don't know why they did that to us, but that's okay. The love this scout speeds my dread again. Okay, freaking flailing on me today? No, sir, that's what I'm, <laughs> that's what I'm not, I'm not down for that. No love disc out here today, okay. <laughs> I'm just like in a rhyming mood today, I don't know why. Okay, here comes a Celio. So, we can go into Bruce Lee, actually. Oh man, I didn't realize that his Zero was level 61 already. He leveled up. Well, that's good, that's good for us, though. Alright, here comes a Celio. I should be able to kill it with just one low sweep, actually. So let's go ahead and do that. Come on, come on, no fake out needed, no fake out needed! Black Belt boosted for the win. Dang right. All right, Bruce Lee, here comes a Milotic. Okay, the Milotic might have a nice time move. Uh, what can Zero do? He can slash because it's stab and I can get the crit. I'm just going to Zero because he is just pure power. Zero is just pure power whenever I don't have like anything, to, unless the Machamps. Machamps would screw me up so bad, but other than that, Zero is just, can just come in and like pure overpower everybody. All right, so let's slash this guy. Okay, it's good. good sign that I'll speed it. And it's stab, and I one shot it. Look at look at zero, man. Look at zero. He's just a beast, man. He is the MVP, man. He is just the MVP, and I don't have a grass type Pokemon on my team, so Wish Catch is kind of scary to go up against. Water and ground types are scary to go up against for me. If I didn't have zero, because look at the work he's gonna put in right here. Look at this power. Bop, get out of here. <laughs> All right, nice, nice, nice. All right, there goes zero, and he's level 62 now. He is two levels over everybody else. I did not mean to do that, but that's okay. Seeking. What is a Seeking? That is the uh, Golden Evolution, right? I don't know why I couldn't remember that. <laughs> I don't know why I couldn't remember that for some reason. Because I saw a C, and I thought it was like a Celio or something again. I was like, no, that, a Seeking is a Golding, right? <laughs> Golding Evolution? Yeah, there we go. Alright. Let's keep on Thunderfanging it. That Seeking ain't got nothing on me. Oh, he can't do like me. Hey. <laughs> he outsped me. Oh man, if he if he used one of that the OKO move, what was it? Horn drill? If he used horn drill, I would have been so mad. I would have been scared actually. Alright, generic is now level 61. Nice. Okay, so probably about one minute left until I get, have to end off this episode right here, but let's keep on going and see if we can find any of these team plasma guys. And I got a big pearl. That is money. That is cash moolah, baby. <laughs> Alright. Yeah, I really wanted to find these Team Plasma members because it feels like we didn't really search up as much as we could have. And this looks like just some sort of random place to battle this guy, so I'm not going to go ahead and do that. I'm going to go back, backtrack, and take that other route that I was supposed to go in right there. And I could avoid this battle right here, actually. Which I did. <laughs> I just did. Okay, now where are these Team Plasma fools? Is that a doctor? I need a doctor. It is a doctor. Okay, so he's gonna heal us up right before we go inside this cave, which tells me that Team Plasma shouldn't be- he, They should be inside this cave. Hopefully. We'll find out in a little bit. And Sawsbuck- Oh, Sawsbuck in the winter form too? Sawsbuck actually kind of scares me. Freaking Horn Lynx. And I don't really have anything that's super against- Super effective against Saw- well, I can't talk. Sawsbuck. But, Zero can come in and put in some work against this Sawsbuck though. I'm just gonna use a fire type because the sauce bug. Oh shoot, that's not stab, is it? That's not stab. That's not stab. That's not stab. That's not stab. Okay, I take it. I can take it. I can take it. But wait, wait, I I can't remember if sauce bug. Uh, does his typing change whenever his form changes as well? Like, would he be a grass and ice type right here, or was he just like grass types too? Actually, I forgot what sauce bug's uh, regular typing is actually. Here comes a Tropius. I could have went into uh, Flipper and used Ice Beam against this Tropius, but I don't trust Flipper because 
He's a crop is a grass type, and he that, he could put in the work against Flipper right there. So, I oh I thought I see I thought <laughs> Tropius lived with one HP. I was like, what? He did it. Okay, oh Tropius, zero. <laughs> nah. All right, so heal my freaking Pokemon, and we'll be on our way. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right. So now that is a good place to end off today's episode right there because yeah. So I'm gonna have to definitely be trying to pre-record a lot more episodes after this. See how far I can get without losing my voice and all that stuff. But, so we're going to leave it like that for now. I'm going to save my game. Hopefully, we don't lose any more Pokemon. Because that will suck for us. But, yeah, that'll be for this episode. So the plan for today is to search up this cave and see if we can find Team Plasma. And uh, progress more with the storyline. And get even more closer to getting to the Elite Four, the Pokemon League. To start ending off this Egglock Challenge. It's crazy, it's crazy. Alright, but yeah, anyway. So, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to pick up that like button down below. And all that good stuff because your support is always greatly appreciated. And I'll go to see you in the next episode. But until then, stay safe, guys.